Now to our Game Night Live Game of the Week. You can't find two teams in the state more different than Pineview and Highland. But former BYU head coach Gary Croton is their offensive coordinator. Pineview tries to run a play every 12 seconds with their spread offense. Highland still runs a triple option that they've always been known for. And it still works. The most important play of the game, though, was made by the Highland defense after the Rams jumped out to a 7-0 lead. Highland linebacker Paul Clark with the pick six. Read it perfectly. Just two minutes into the game, the Rams had a 14-0 lead. Mind you, played catch up the rest of the way. Literally, the Panthers were chasing Highland running backs all night long. Ben Boren gets things started with the 56-yard touchdown run. The Rams running their old school triple option offense to perfection. After Bourne, it was Usman Diumbié who takes a pitch from Hunter Lambert, Nathan Johnson. He gets into the game and he finds the end zone. Diumbié scored twice. He is speed and also strength. He shows it here, fighting his way into the end zone a second time. Second half, another big run by Boren. Down the sideline, 41 yards for another Highland touchdown. He had five carries for 133 yards. They scored six rushing touchdowns by four different backs. Nephi Hosea, nine carries, 91 yards, and a score. 517 yards rushing for the Highland Rams. Pineview offense had its moments. McLeod Croton at quarterback and Michael Moore, the receiver, had a connection going. Moore had nine catches for 180 yards and two touchdowns. Croton passed for 410 yards and five touchdowns. Isaiah Moten had five catches for 134 yards and a score. And Dayla Reimer, two touchdowns. But the Highland defense, despite allowing 35 points, was outstanding. They sacked Croton four times. Christian Hilborn with two sacks. Isaiah Messina had a couple as well. And Highland capped off the game with a safety. They moved to 2-0 with a 52-35 win. Pineview drops to 0-2.